Hey guys, so this morning I was by one of my apiaries and uh, Laurie and I found this little swarm hanging in the tree. So we put it in a nuke box, brought it to a different apiary. I opened up the front door and about a thousand bees flew out and the queen did as well. I saw her land right in the grass, right in front of the hive. I tried to pick her up quick and put her back in, but she took off. And they just floated around in the air for about 15, 20 minutes. And she landed over on this piece of junk netting. Um, I knew I wasn't going to be able to shake them out of there very easily. So I waited with my queen catcher. And I finally saw her. And I caught her. And I'm not sure if you guys can see that very well in there. But I put her in my queen catcher. Now she's stuck in there. So I'm going to leave it like that and pretty soon the bees out here will get the message that the queen is in the nuke box and they'll go in the door right in the front. So hopefully it worked out because I knew there was no way I was going to be able to shake them out of all this mesh. They're just intertwined all over in there. Really bad place for a swarm to land. So I hope you guys can learn that trick. Another thing you can do with a nuke like this, if you think they're going to fly off, is you can cut up one of those plastic queen excluders and you can put it on the front door to keep your queen from taking off. But uh, hopefully these bees will fly into this nuke box pretty quick here. And uh, I'm wondering if I should leave it open maybe too. And uh, leave it open for about 15 minutes. And I think all these bees will go right down into this nuke box for me. And I'll be able to cage them up, close it up, go on vacation. You guys get out there and enjoy your bees.